Hey, hi guys. Welcome to this YouTube video that I'm gonna make just because I'm bored. Um, I decided to fly to Mallorca alone because like mentally I was drained and some things happened in the past weeks that I just needed a break. And I decided what other way to give me a break than go to Mallorca and <clears throat> Just put my bunda in the sand and like sea and beaches. So that's why I'm here. But now that I'm here, I'm thinking like, why did I do this alone though? Because what am I going to do? I didn't even plan activities or nothing. I'm just here. And like, now that I'm here, I'm going to figure out what I'm going to do. Um, Flight was crazy. I, I literally was too early there. She said I couldn't check in, so I had to wait two hours to check in. Then I had to wait two hours for the flight, but then we didn't leave on time. We left like 30 minutes later, but we still got here on time, which doesn't make sense to me, but you know. And then I have like a headache, like in the plane and everything. And yeah, I got here and I was like hungry. They say like the buffet is done. They're like, there's like bread for y'all. They close at 12, so you can get bread and cheese. So I ate toasty with cheese. And now I'm here in my room, which is really nice. I just wanted to start a video like this because... I don't know, you know, I just want to document this experience. I uploaded a vlog last year, but I just do things when I'm bored. And I want to do it though. So... This is gonna be fun to see. <laughs> to see what's gonna happen on the fun. <laughs> Good morning. Um, like I said, I have no idea what I'm doing here. So we're just going to wing it. I have to go to the supermarket to like get water and toothpaste. But I'm going to at least shower and put on some sunscreen and have breakfast. Because breakfast is like till 10 or something. I'm going to the beach. I know I'm going to the beach because it's like 25 Celsius today. It's hot. It's hot. So, like, I'm excited for that. Yeah. This is literally my problem. I plan my outfit out for like five days straight. Now I come here, I have no idea what I'm gonna wear. And I'll be like, I don't have enough clothes. But I do have enough clothes though. I bought a thick ass suitcase. I'm not gonna do a white one because I'm gonna have breakfast. <sighs> I can't get in the porch lighting. What is this? I don't like it and it's white you know you know what's the problem me with white clothes is a no and i got so many white clothes with me i have etiquette but it's always something and the white like gets dirty i do want to go like without it 
I feel like people will keep like watching me because I have like pointy nipples. Social anxiety right now. <laughs> I am just sitting alone eating breakfast. Anybody has someone with them? Oh no, it's an old lady. I don't feel bad now. But yeah, it's like okay. and bought water and toothpaste <laughs> i went outside which is cold <laughs> i went with like this to take a walk to the supermarket and it's cool as hell outside so what i'm gonna do is um i'm gonna work out now because i can <laughs> I don't even care that I'm on vacation. I'm still gonna work out as usual as I should. Wait. The water is too big for the fridge. You know what? Never mind. I don't care. I'm gonna work out as I should. This is gonna be the highlight of my day, Loki. I don't even care that I'm being more your car. It's just like I need to pump that boom up. That workout. Ooh, look at my damn. <laughs> damn. What? I have to turn on the lights. Wait. Wow. That workout was whack. That was the one of the worst workouts I had when I the gym doesn't have the equipment I usually use, so to like go struggle with that equipment was not in my mood today. So I just left. I'm not gonna stay there if I don't feel comfortable. So I'm gonna try that again tomorrow. And now, I'm gonna get my laptop, try to plan some activity. I think I'm gonna snorkel. Snorkel, I don't know how you say that in English compared to, ooh, yeah, I didn't show y'all this. This is my view right here, like, yeah. <laughs> like this room is so cute, this is the bed. And that's my bathroom with all my stuff and the private toilet and here I put all my stuff, my clothes. I basically moved in. <laughs> so yeah, I'm just gonna figure out. Let me take a shower first because I sweat it. <sighs> because I saw the boat leaves at two o'clock, so I really wanna go at two o'clock because <sighs> Two o'clock is warm. It's like 23. So I'm just gonna figure out if I cannot book it via my laptop, I'm gonna call them. I don't even care because I really, I really wanna go. <laughs> 2 30. I don't care. I'm sorry. 2 30 though? This takes too long for me. Like, I should have done this at home, but I didn't. I'm lying. I had time. I just didn't want to do anything about it. I didn't actually believe I was coming to Mallorca, even though I already booked the flight. But oh no, I'm gonna be with children. I have nothing against children. It's just I don't like loud children right now. I don't need that right now. You know, I'm I'm. I'm trying to heal and stuff. Hearing children in the background is not gonna help my healing journey. Journey. I booked an activity that canceled it because they thought like Dutch was my only language I can speak. Like boo, I speak like four languages. And they wanted to give me a refund. I'm like boo, I don't want a refund. I want to go, and they were like, no, it's fully booked. So. Yeah, yummer. You can't go today because it's fully booked. Because duh. It's the hottest day of the week. But I decided that I'm going to 
walk and i saw there's like jet ski so maybe i'll maybe i'll do that you know i only live once anyway so yeah this is my outfit nice slipper comfy i have like this thing my mom gave me i like like it for like beach stuff and i have my bikini and my belly chains <laughs> my glasses and my headphones and I'm ready to go. Just finished chat skiing, bro. That was so amazing. It's one of the top 10 moments in my life. <laughs> I felt like on top of the world, I was Screaming. I was going so fast. I was going like 50 on the way. It was so great. It made me like, bro, all my, all my like sadness and like overthinking stuff left. <laughs> bro, it was, it was the money's worth. Like it was actually the money's worth. I'm just gonna chill here. Enjoy the sun. I'm satisfied with today. To be honest, so as I said, I feel on top of the world with the jet ski. It wasn't even on my planning, but that fact. And now I'm going back to my hotel. I'm just walking because the hotel is like a one minute walk from the beach. Two hours later okay, so i'm done taking a shower and i'm gonna do my edges and my makeup and i'm going to the city because i found out zara closed at 9 30. maybe they have like cope avant here but i don't know i'm going i was planning to just, like just chill here but let's be adventurous and go <laughs> so i'm gonna listen to some yeet you know to my they can do it like this like me got them copy the check like me I just got like a fat <laughs> I just got a fat pimple why why today why on my forehead though bro that shit is huge proceed by the way the reason why I used color corrector is because I have a lot of hyper oh I look weird right now. I have a lot of hyperpigmentation and like I'm doing monthly chemical peels like to take it off. And the day that I arrive back in the Netherlands, I'm doing another one again. And this is gonna be worse. So I'm gonna be peeling for like weeks. And I'm a little bit excited for that because it's the moment I've been waiting for for years with suffering with pigmentation. But now I gotta use like things on my head it looks like paint to just like take this stitches off that I can correctly use a foundation that covers it because the different types of color doesn't mix well with my foundation <laughs> t-shirt and so short looking cute i wanted to wear a crop top but up like i'll know where i feel like uncomfortable so i thought like no before y'all come for me i'm watching cowboy debop now 
So don't be like, you're a fake fan. I, I'm watching you, okay? Leave me alone. <laughs> So it is now 10.30, I already washed my face even though it looks like I still have mascara on <laughs> and I'm gonna watch some Harry Potter and do some Duolingo, maybe learn a little bit of Japanese, I already journaled and yeah it's just gonna be a peaceful night till I fall asleep and we'll see what happens tomorrow. Today went by really fast. I just woke up really lazy and tired. I don't even know why because I didn't actually do a lot yesterday. I went on the boat trip even though they didn't let us snorkel because the waters were like dangerous just as when I went on the jet ski. We were just on the boat for two hours. I'm gonna take a walk and see where I end up. And if I have to come back, I do have a bus fare the bus fare so I can come back home with the bus. I don't know if I should do my makeup or not. Should I? I never do my makeup perfectly but I like to practice so I'm just gonna put on some music and do my makeup real quick. Okay, so I'm kind of done. I wanted to do something simple because I don't even know if I'm going to a party or not. What is this? Ah, uh -uh, this how many do? My shit been looking at she says the pool. But I know what's that ashy though. Sure. That ashy bruh. I don't actually drink. So I'm just gonna find out if there's like a karaoke or something. Ah! <laughs> what the fuck am I doing? See, when I do when I do weird decisions, I get nervous. Like I don't actually know what is going on. What am I doing? I don't even know what am I wearing. I think I'm gonna take my varsity jacket with me because I think it's gonna be a little bit cold because even when I was like eating at the restaurant, I, it was like chilling. I was like calling with someone and then I constantly had to put my jacket on and off, on and off. So I know it's gonna be cold outside. It's not that much I can mix with the varsity jacket. Oh. Oh, what am I doing? <laughs> this is the thing I've been asking myself for days. What am I doing? What is going on? Housekeeping came and cleaned my room. They sweep 
change the bed sheets and that's it i thought i were at least gonna like wipe the counter because my counter is dirty with makeup and i don't have alles reiniger with me i don't even know what that is in english i'm sorry the thing that you put in the water and you clean summer <laughs> I don't like this. I don't like this at all. I have my cross on. And I don't like this outfit. What? See? I can't pack clothes. <laughs> Let me test the weather real quick. Motherfucker outside. I know I swear. The best way to piss me off is for me to not know what I wear. Why I literally packed my suitcase myself and I was playing the outfit for five days. Fuck it, I'm going like this. <laughs> and I look fat because I ate two plates at the buffet as I should because I'm paying for it. So I ate two plates. It was so weird because when he came to me, he was like, are you done? I'm like, no, but my plate was empty. And then he came back, he saw me with a full plate again. I was like, that's embarrassing, but I'm a gym girl. I eat a lot. That's a lie. At home, I don't even eat that much. But now I'm taking advantage of the situation, you know, as I should. I'm sorry, I'm taking a walk. I'm taking a walk and I just wanted to pick up my camera to see how fine I look because I keep getting cat called. Even the woman was like, que bellissima. I'm like, bitch, I should live here for my self confidence. Because clearly people are so nice here. Like, how are you doing? You're so pretty. <laughs> look at me acting like I can't get a compliment. I barely get compliments. So, this makes me kind of happy. <laughs> I've been walking for an hour actually I went to the club and the club was not for me I'm sorry it was it was diet it was diet and I don't speak that even if it was a Dutch club I wouldn't go because I don't know Dutch music like that and it was a nice walk people are really nice here so I met some people at breakfast and they're gonna take a bike ride so I'm gonna join them. <laughs> if my mom sees this, she'll kill me afterward because she told me like, don't talk to strangers, don't do this, don't do that. But bro, I'm here. Either I'm gonna sit here in my room till I go to that aquarium or I'm gonna bike with those people. And they seem like really nice, but you know, we still gotta be careful, but it's gonna be a fun thing to do. My problem with white t-shirts and stuff is, like, literally, I could spend the whole day stressing about if it's gonna get dirty or not. And then it ended up getting dirty at the last. I wore the shirt once. I bought ice. I bought a, a muffin. And I was like, yeah, I got home without it getting dirty. Like, I had, like, a little chocolate here. That shit broke my heart for real, but... Yeah, I'm gonna wear this for the bike ride. I know my butt's gonna hurt because I haven't rode a bike in a long time. Two hours later. After I went and rode that bike for an hour to the city, I came back because I couldn't anymore. My butt hurt and I didn't think I would survive if I would bike more. 
So I came back. I ate paella. And I came back to the hotel. I took a really good power nap. I literally slept outside on the pool chair. Then I came in, slept inside. In 15 minutes, I got to be downstairs to eat dinner. And then I'm going to go to the city. I'm not even going to put makeup or anything because I'm so tired. Yeah, that's basically it for right now. So, um, I already woke up that breakfast, I cleaned my room, I'm gonna do some school stuff and later on I'm gonna go to the city to visit the museum and go to the aquarium if I could get a ticket because literally I'm calling them then I'm picking up. But yeah, it's warm, I hope I get like a good outfit for the whole day and after that I'm planning to lay at the beach because Tomorrow is Sunday. Almost everything is like closed. So I'm just trying to figure out what to do with the last days. My nails are so cute. I asked someone what color I should get to say white. And I got some hearts. It's a little like all grown but it's still cute. I look crazy right now. I went to the church. I prayed. I cried. So don't judge my makeup right now. This is so pretty. This is too hot for me, low key. Like I feel, I feel like SpongeBob right now. I think I'm just in like a pan getting cooked. I don't know. I don't know if I put my sunscreen or not. But I didn't get to enjoy Mallorca like I'm supposed to because one, I was nervous because it's my, my first time traveling alone. Even though I'm an independent person, traveling to another country which I don't live in alone. And I'm, I don't drink and stuff. And I'm not a party person, especially when I'm alone. So I didn't go to any clubs. I didn't go to get drinks. I only went out to eat. And in the night, I literally am in the hotel because I don't like walking alone at night either in a foreign country. I just have to adapt to it because it's my first time. I can't judge myself like that. I'm actually really proud that I came on my own. And I really enjoyed it, the peace. You know, I live on my own, but being in another country, exploring things on my own, it's really fun and not to be with people that may ruin the moment or not. So actually I'm really 
grateful for this experience and I'm gonna do it again I don't know if I'm gonna do it in October or not it depends but I know I'm gonna do this again and now that I like filmed everything I have it forever in the memory so that's why I like filming things sometimes and how it turns out I may post it or not I don't care if it gets views or not it's just an experience thing that I do people judge you at the end of the day anyway so several days later okay so today is my last day in my workout it's one o'clock i haven't done anything yet i just wanted to rest i finished watching harry potter because i really wanted to finish it and get it out of the way um yeah today i don't know if i'm actually gonna do anything i'll just see how i feel i just want to rest enough so that i don't go home and i'm tired and i want to like sleep because when i get back home i immediately have school i have my therapy session and i have my chemical pill so it's really a busy day tomorrow and the day after that i have school then i have work then i have to learn then i have to do um groceries so I just want to take a time to rest. I don't think I'll re regret taking rest because it's what I actually needed. I have a school project I have to do because I'm a class representative and I have to do something about it. So I'm going to do that today because today is the only time I have to do it. Um, and the content that I filmed, everything I filmed, I have to transfer it to my laptop to edit it, to post it because my phone is full <laughs> it's full now i don't have any more space my phone keeps overheating so i really have to you know i really have to transfer those things and like clean out my phone this was actually great let me see when they're picking me up my flight leaves at 8 a.m <laughs> that means they're gonna pick me up at 4 50. I think I'll have everything packed by tonight anyways because I really want to take time to rest and do everything. I like leaving my room clean. I don't care about like housekeeping. It's like manners. So I'll just pack everything I'm not I know I'm not going to touch today. Most of my clothes. It's hot outside, so I don't think I'm gonna wear almost anything today. And I'll see if I like go to the aquarium or not. Because it is something I really wanted to do. And you know, I gotta have some balls and just do it. Would they fight otherwise? I hope the quality is good because I'm not filming this again. Okay, so <laughs> the aquarium was great. Um, I saw a lot of sharks, big ass sharks, fishes. I even saw Dory. I saw a piranha and it was really cool because I've been scared of piranhas my whole life. And to actually see one, to actually see one in person was really cool. 
um, then I came back here because I was dying of hunger because I only ate breakfast and <laughs> I ate like two plates and dessert and the fruit and then I went to the beach I walked a little bit just to see the sunset and I was sitting there and then like the cold hit me I was like hell no I'm coming back and I'm just sitting outside to watch like the sky because the later it gets the more purplish it gets and I really I love sunrise and sunset I don't know why and now I'm gonna just watch a movie clean up pack my suitcase and learn Japanese and finish the school project to kill time because at 4 a.m. they're gonna 4 30 they're gonna pick me up so I have to wake up at like 3 something and then I'm gonna go to the airport and my flight leaves at 8 a.m. The other side I'm like 8 a.m. bruh that's early but on the other side it's like it's good because I have stuff to do when I go back to the Netherlands so I think it's a great thing that I'm gonna be there early in the morning and I think I'm just gonna chill outside right now and I wanted to finish the video here. I'm not a vlogger or something. I just did this because I don't like it when I go on vacation and nobody can take pictures of me. But it's my own fault because I decided to come on my own. But it's okay. That's why I filmed it. I'm just posting it because I'm bored. <laughs> so yeah, this was a great experience for me. I'm really happy with it. I'm healed now because I came here to heal from the things that been happening since my birthday so <laughs> it's a cool thing that I did and I'm gonna do this again I'm happy that I'm gonna go home I'm happy that I'm gonna go home with like a fresh mindset like refresh and everything I'm just gonna work hard on my stuff and the things I wanna accomplish so I'm gonna end the video here so subscribe if you want to because I post things when I like when I'm bored I post songs when I'm bored <laughs> I'm not a consistent person if I take it serious then I take it serious but I'm literally just me so oh and stream my songs if you want to and follow the gram peace <laughs> Yeah.